Bill, our private chauffeur, has brought us to Newgrange, and we're gonna go explore. It's a thousand years older than the pyramids. If you're lucky, you can. But I wonder how they thought to do that. Well, I mean, it's only when you get up there that you don't. The cabin, the tour lasts about one hour. We'll be here in one hour to collect you. This way. Newgrange is 5,000 years old, older than the pyramids, and was built with a roof box the sun comes through and illuminates the winter solstice. They believe that it was an area to possibly communicate. It wasn't held sealed off for the dead. The dead were interned, their human remains they've carbon dated, and people could come in and out. We're going to go inside, but there's no photography inside. It's a beautiful day today. Yesterday was rainy and cold. Definitely bring your layers. This UNESCO complex has 40 different mounds. Newgrange is the one I'm going in today, but there's three different ones that you can enter and explore. From carbon dating, they know this area was built in 3200 BC, and it was mainly excavated starting in 1962. What do you think happened here? Why did generations of people build this 5,000 years ago? Well, I have to go to you. The museum explains many things about Newgrange and shares many of the things that were found in the tombs. Archaeologists and scientists believe that this is how people must have lived at the time when Newgrange was constructed. The gigantic and heavy stones came from many kilometers away, some 20 and some 40 kilometers away. They suspect this is how they moved them. The Newgrange tour was phenomenally interesting. I highly recommend it. I'm very curious what inspired people to build that monument 5,000 years ago. UNESCO sites are always worth it. Enjoy.